Then you boil your water. So we're going to make you some potato candy today, okay? And we're going to do it for Ty's World, okay? All right, so stick around. So now we got the potatoes a boiling. That's right. So these are the ingredients we're going to work with today for the potato candy. That's right. Mm -hmm. Okay, so after your potatoes get done boiling, you want to mix them up with some butter and just a dash of milk. Actually, I just used two teaspoons of butter and just a couple dashes of milk. And you want to get them to about this texture to where they're still pretty thick. And just a dash of salt. So, and there you have it. Mm-hmm. Okay, so now y'all, you want to take them potatoes. The mashed potatoes you have and you want to put them out into a measuring cup and you want to put them about a half cup into a measuring cup at a time okay okay so you need to melt about a stick of butter or a half cup of butter and have it ready okay so by now you need to pour that melted butter into those mashed potatoes mm -hmm. okay so now we need a tablespoon of vanilla extract Mm-hmm. That's right. Then you want to mix that all in. So now you should have this mixture going on. That's right. Keep it going. All right, folks. So you need six to seven cups of powdered sugar to pour into your Potato butter vanilla mixture. All right, so let's get started. So we come up to this consistency and we think we can use one more cup of powdered sugar. Okay? All right. So we want it to this consistency. Whenever you can't mix it, it's pretty well the consistency that you need it. That way it can harden up after you put it in the refrigerator. Remember to refrigerate for 45 minutes. So at this point, you want to powder sugar your parchment paper, and then you want to smooth it out on that parchment paper. So make sure that parchment paper is completely covered with that powdered sugar. So now you want to put those potatoes that you already mixed up onto that parchment paper. Mm-hmm. Okay, at this point, you want to add some powdered sugar and flatten it down. Okay, we're going to start flattening it down even more with this rolling pin. All right, you want to smooth the powdered sugar around the rolling pin so it doesn't stick before you start rolling out this candy. Are you ready, y'all? Come on now. Okay, you're going to want to keep rolling out this candy until you get it to about this width. Okay. About one-fourth one width. Keep repeating your steps of pouring your powdered sugar over your rolling pin and over your candy. It's going to take a few minutes until you get it to this desired width. Do you understand, y'all? All right, just keep on working with it. Even if you gotta get your hands in it, y'all, do you just do what you have to, okay? All right. All right, people, start adding your peanut butter on this candy. Make sure you stir that peanut butter first before you start putting it on there. Get it all stirred up. Get it on that candy. 
Then you start spreading it out evenly onto this candy, okay? Come on, y'all. Let's go. And now, y'all, the peanut butter should be spread evenly over this candy. Just wait till next. Okay, so we're going to turn this candy around to where it is horizontal. And we're going to roll it up evenly. You're going to start with a small section, rolling it up. You can use the paper and that will help you. All right, come on, y'all. So you might want to add some powdered sugar to the back of it to help roll it over. It'll keep it from sticking and keep it from tearing a little. All right, let's get it. All right, so by now, you should have it looking about like this. Just keep using your paper to keep rolling it on it. If you have to keep adding powdered sugar to keep it from sticking, just keep on doing it. That's fine. Just keep on going, y'all. Okay? Just keep on going. It should be looking about like this right here. Okay? All right now. Come on. Yeah, we about got it. Now add some more powdered sugar to the top. Gives it some more flavor. Keeps it from sticking. And it also looks nice. All right. How y'all like that? Huh? How do y'all like that? Mm hmm Yeah, y'all love that, right? Come on now. Let's get it. Looks nice. Now that is some potato candy. Let's put it in the refrigerator. Let's let it chill for a little while. Okay, and then when it chills real nice, hardens up some, we're going to cut it into slices. How about that? And we're going to have some potato candy. All right. Yep, the how you do it. All right. Is that right, Tay? Yep. All right. All right, so whenever you have it ready, go ahead and roll it on up into that paper and then put it in the refrigerator so it, whenever it's chilled, it's already formed and ready to cut. All right. So That's you right. That's right. So say hi. Hi. Yeah. All right. So come on, y'all. Let's get ready for this potato candy. And here's what it's going to look like in the refrigerator. This is the final result of the candy. Peanut butter is on my hands. Hey, we love potato candy, and this is your final result, y'all. Yeah. Mm hmm Stack the plug Let's bricks. get in it, y'all. Stack the plug bricks. <laughs> boom, boom, boom. <laughs> Guys, coming to hit that like button and pop. Child, you got your mouth full of that stuff. Yeah. You must love Daddy's potato candy, don't you? Yeah.